The Draw.io integration extension for VS Code lets you view and edit Draw.io diagrams directly within VS Code. Now here I've already installed the extension, so let's take a look at it in action. Now to create a new Draw.io diagram, I could create a file with one of these extensions down here. So you can see Draw.io.svg, for example. If I just create a new file with one of those extensions, it will open a new diagram. I can also use the command palette to create a new diagram. So I'm going to open the command palette with Control shift p or Command shift p and say Draw.io new. And I want Draw.io new Draw.io diagram here. And when I select this, you can see it's asking me where I want to save this. So I'll just save this as test draw IO. And you can see that it's now opening up this new file directly in my VS Code editor here. So I'm going to go and collapse the Explorer so we have a bit more space here. And I'll get my standard draw IO interface directly within VS Code. So I can go in and start adding some shapes. So I can say, let's go add a rectangle, for example. We'll say hello here. I can just move this about. And then let's go add a more fun shape. So let's find something like the little cloud here. I'll just drag that out as well. And I'll say world over here. I can go in and start customizing the colors if I wanted to. So let's make this one pink, for example, and start connecting these as I want as well. So I get all of my Draw.io customization options, and I can really create some really complex diagrams using this. And then it's being displayed directly in VS Code. So the standard keyboard shortcuts like Control-Z or Command-Z, those are also going to work. So I can just undo and redo here, and then save the file with Command-S or Control-S on Mac. So this is a great way to both view Draw.io diagrams and then edit them or create new ones as well. And once you actually create a nice diagram, if you don't want to leave it in the Draw.io format here, I can actually go and export it. So I can go to File here. I could say Export. And I could ex export this as an SVG or a PNG. I'm going to select PNG here, export it as an image file. And I'll just say, call it test.png. And when I go back to the Explorer over here, you can see I now have test.png. And this diagram has now been exported. So you get the whole flow, everything from going and viewing editing, and then exporting the Draw.io diagram directly within VS Code. This has really just scratched the surface of what the Draw.io integration extension can do, so be sure to check out the documentation for more details.